Rushak Tadalka, uh, you are partner at uh, Rodoland Partners. Uh, my first question will be how does uh, Rodoland Partner uh, support its clients in meeting uh, sustainability criteria and standards? Right. So, uh, first of all, thank you, Ifki, for having us on this occasion of 140, uh, 47th Annual General Meeting. Uh, on sustainability standards, uh, Rodoland Partner being a multidisciplinary firm, we assist and uh, advise our clients on several uh, environment, social, governance principles and uh, thereby advise comprehensively on ESG reporting, due diligence, supply chain reporting, services like uh, internationally uh, CSRD reporting principles. So we are advising them wholesomely on all the sustainability uh, criteria and wherever we can advise them on how European companies can implement them as well in India. So on that end we are advising uh, whole lot of stuff to our companies and clients in India. Okay, and what sustainable practices have you uh, implemented to drive both environmental and business growth? Yeah, so in, in India we have actually, uh, first of all, digitalization. That is one major thing for our own internal growth that we have done most of our uh, servers and everything. Now we are moving on to cloud. So, so a lot of focus is on digitalization. And on um, social and governance, we are doing a lot of activities. So last year, we had our 10th year anniversary in Pune, where we did a tree plantation, where we planted more than 200 trees. Uh, we are doing a lot of activities. Uh, our employees are encouraged to use public transport. So we have shuttle services. Now, good to uh, announce that we have almost one third of our people are using public transport. And uh, uh, we are doing a lot of uh, other ESG activities like uh, education and, and, and supporting uh, CSR activities uh, where uh, sw uh, international uh, companies can help in skill development. So those are the initial uh, activities that we've started and yeah, uh, it's just the beginning we would say. Okay, thank you. Uh, last question will be, uh, what uh, are the key opportunities for growth that you foresee both in the, in the Indian market and in on the French market? Yes, so uh, both uh, inbound and outbound. So, so we have our offices in Paris and Strasbourg and in India we have six offices. So we are actively working all together. So companies going from India to uh, Europe and particularly in France, we are advising them comprehensively on as we just said, sustainability on, on actually setting up projects over there, global mobility, where people are actually going from either of the jurisdictions to the other. We are advising how all the regulations related to taxation, legal regulations should be complied with, and thereby assisting businesses to actually uh, consummate a lot of transactions. So uh, on that end, we are helping them. Of course, uh, as I mentioned, sustainability is there while uh, other sector specific things being in these f f sectors and advising companies on establishing them. We are advising them in manufacturing, technology, uh, healthcare, various industries and sectors where we are assisting companies in a whole lot of multidisciplinary, not just tax accounting and uh, regulatory, but uh, a lot of other activities as well. Okay, thank you, Rushak. Thanks thank a lot. you.